Good afternoon, Stephenville. I am multimedia editor Erin Cooper here with your online on-time update for Tuesday, May 18th. For several months, the Dublin ISD Board of Trustees has been discussing the future of its facilities. The discussion continued Monday night at the Board's regular May meeting and included issues at the elementary and middle school campuses. Look for details in the Wednesday edition of the Empire Tribune. Also coming in tomorrow's edition is a sneak peek at the expansion and renovation of the Erath County Jail. Staff writer Amanda Kimball has that story. One local developer is moving mountains in Morgan Mill as his new subdivision makes waves of improvement for the entire town. Find out who he is and what he is doing tomorrow. And now, with 60 Seconds of Sports, here's sports editor Brad Keith. Good afternoon, Stephen Mill. Tarleton State has added a second name to its 2010 men's basketball recruiting class, adding Denison High School standout Coleman First to the roster for next season. First was the District 9-4A Defensive Player of the Year and helped Denison to the second round of the 4A playoffs. It looks like a Stephen Mill High School graduate may be headed to the NCAA Division II National Track and Field Championships. Claire Goodman is a member of the Texans 4x400 meter relay that ran a provisional qualifying time last week in San Antonio. Catch the full story Wednesday in sports. A group of future Yellow Jacket football players teamed up to qualify for state and 7-on-7 football. Check out Wednesday's sports page to see which 6th grade boys are on the team. Soccer camp is coming this summer and plans and registration are already underway. Do you have a young soccer enthusiast in the family? If so, check out Wednesday's paper to learn how he or she can hone their skills right here in Stephenville this summer. This has been a look at your sports update for today. I'm Brad Keith.